Good morning to all. What a beautiful one it is. On the sunny first day of daylight savings time, yes. I'd like to share the spring prayer by Iris Hessel. I myself am ready for longer days. I'm anxious to see the ground all over again. <laughs> I have a putting on boots. <laughs> a prayer for spring. O oh God, my Father, creator of the sun, which makes the seed, I rejoice in the gift of ever-growing light. With joyfulness I greet this new spring that rises from a gray winter of long nights. Great and generous are you, my God, who has given us the rich variety of ever-changing seasons. For this, I thank you. I think we all need to say thank you for bringing us to the winter and a special thank you for the precious hope of spring. Mm -hmm. Are there any announcements for the Good News Church? I didn't make the bulletin, but um, this Thursday is Ladies' Day. Um, if you notice in your flyer, um, don't be disappointed. Van Averings is not going to be speaking this Thursday. He's yeah. speaking in June. <laughs> uh, but um, the June um, program has been moved to this Thursday, and that is um, Susan Roselle, who is the director of the Children's Center, Sandwich Children's Center. And for those of you who've been around, community for a long time realized that that grew out of this congregation. And Susan Roselle um, is the daughter-in-law of the original chairman of the board um, of the Children's Center. And we're lucky that she's they retired back to Sandwich at just the right time when they needed, they needed a new director. Anyway, she's going to talk about her background and the background of the Children's Center. Um, and all are welcome. It is it is a ladies aid program. The business meeting starts at 11:15, but if you come at 12 with your sandwich, you can eat lunch with us, and then hear the program at 12:30. Um, and guys are invited. For sure. <laughs> which is to uh, vote to approve the expenditure of $6,800, which was a accidental oversight by the Board of Trustees uh, for the removal and disposal of the shingles from this roof as a project that had been approved by the 2020 budget. So I please ask that all members and anyone interested in attending, please remain in your seats. We'll have that meeting directly afterwards. And then those who, um, would not like to participate, uh, please feel free to head directly downstairs and have first dibs on the wonderful spread of food and fellowship uh, provided by Tony and Michelle. Um, I do need to have 15 members of the church for a quorum, so uh, please don't think your vote doesn't count. It does. <laughs> so again, right after worship, we'll go ahead and get started with this special meeting. Thank you. Before we go into the Ministry of Christian Greeting, I just wanted to say, with all of the news and all of the spread with the coronavirus, I wanted to just address that, that some people are not as comfortable shaking hands, hugging right now, and we just all need to just kind of be respectful of that, because everyone, you know, um, everyone's different. So I know a lot of times we're out and we're shaking, and we can still, like, if you want to shake hands and hug, that's fine. But if someone's like, oh, you know, not today, that's, you know, we just look at each other and just see where are you with that, okay? And just be respectful of that. Um, 
Also, there is talk um, of, and hopefully uh, maybe within a couple weeks you'll be getting a list, and if you choose to, uh, it'll be a list of non-perishables that um, will be maybe handy to have on hand for your, your own self and family, but also we're going to suggest having a bag ready just in case in the event that anyone in the town of Sandwich should have to be quarantined for two weeks, that we can have this bag and put it on their doorstep of non-perishable uh, paper items, detergents, food, you know, so there'll be a list coming around in a, in a week or so, um, hopefully, that we, um, you know, are just making that suggestion for people who want to do that. And, and what's the worst that can happen? No one in Sandwich has to be quarantined for two weeks, right? That's good and you have extra non-perishable things. Okay, so that's the worst case scenario. So we just, it's good to be prepared. And um, that was it. Well, as, as Pastor Deb suggested, please greet your friends and neighbors with a traditional Christian greeting.